there is step two, because after we have this inbox full of stuff, we should really go through it right now. So, um, and if you're like most of people, uh, one to-do list is not enough, because you are doing many things on, on many levels. So, let's start with projects. What is a project? Uh, David Allen defi defines a project, every action that requires more than one step. For example, I mean, creating birthday party is not an um, action because you can't do it in one step. Creating this course is not an action because a 10-step course, course cannot be done in one step. So, I mean, this, this all requires more than one step. So, this is a project. So, uh, it's not like something very complicated. Project is everything that requires more. So, what we should do is use the inbox, right? And from the inbox, we should move stuff and organize it into projects. So, for example, there is an example of thing like that. Pretty much old school, but it works. There are certain different projects, and you can just move stuff from here, from inbox, to your projects, organize, and then later move with the projects. But again, it doesn't work for me. It's too much hustle, too much paperwork. Uh, I don't like papers. Use as many projects as you can in Nosby. Adding a project is very easy. Just click on New Project, write a short name, a description, it's optional, and create it. Now that your project is there, you can add actions to it, you can reorder the project in your project list. There are different types of projects. Inbox is a container of actions and stuff to be processed. Here's a project for my brother to create a birthday party for him. Nosby are all added tasks to Nosby, my private stuff, um, just unrelated stuff to my private life. And this new video. Remember to keep your project names short and descriptive. In each project, you can add actions in various ways, using the form here, email, and third-party applications like Twitter or Jot. If you misplaced an action, you can simply edit it. Just double-click on an action, and just move it to a different project. And it's there. Forget priorities in each project. Just reorder your actions within simple drag and drop to make sure which comes first and which comes second. The same goes to projects. You can reorder them anytime. Many people like projects and sub-projects and sub-sub-projects. I prefer something easier. For example, tags. Here are two of my project tags. For example, my new video project will have a tag Nosby. And when I click on, it, on a Nosby tag here, I can see only projects tagged with Nosby. If I want to see my private tasks, I just click on the private tag. And if I want to see all of my projects, I just click here. Nosby makes it easy to manage your projects. Remember to organize everything into projects. If you're using Nosby, you'll be able to easily keep your mind focused and project organized uh, by tags and prioritized by simple reordering. Always remember to add your reference material to all your projects.